the function of stomach is not absorption or digestion to make it as a crime a fluid like and it makes it absorbable with b12 it is different the b12 in food is attached with a protein that protein should be digested to liberate a free b12 it's done by the hydrochloric acid it is secreted by the parietal cells the same parietal cells secrete another fact the intrinsic factor the freed b12 now gets attached with another protein which is called haptocorin this haptocorin and b12 complex is accompanied by the intrinsic factor which is also secreted by the parietal cells we need parietal cells in the stomach for the secretion of hydrochloric acid and intrinsic factor the intrinsic factor accompanies this complex up to the duodenum the first part of the small intestine in the duodenum the haptocorin which is carrying the b12 is digested this free b12 will attach itself with the intrinsic factor so you need hydrochloric acid for the breakdown of the protein you need intrinsic factor for the transport of b12 if by any chance they are less in number or they are absent you are going to have a b12 deficiency how can you get this deficiency one medicines those medicines which you take to treat hyperacidity or ulcer like proton pump inhibitors there is no acid at all in when there is no acid the protein which is accompanying the b12 in the food cannot be digested second thing by any chance if you have a surgery to remove a part of the stomach the number of parietal cells may be decreased and also you may have less intrinsic factor so absence of hydrochloric acid and absence of intrinsic factor it may be because of surgery or gastritis or medicines then the big possibility of getting a b12 deficiency even though you take a lot of b12 in your food you need hydrochloric acid you need intrinsic factor if you go for a surgery a part of stomach is removed after surgery also you will be prescribed the same medicine which completely takes away the acid from your stomach total an acidity so this is very important as far as b12 absorption is concerned you may get a b12 deficiency because of this problem also